Welcome everyone to Stevens Cards. It's Thursday night again. Welcome, welcome. few minutes for people to start rolling in. Hope everybody's had a good Thursday. I see Jason. What's up, buddy? Already lost my pen. Off to a bad start. Just had it, too. Just had it. Let's Packrat, what's up, buddy? Hey, Sam Arnold. Everybody doing all right? I will be once I track the ink pen down again. There's Bob Ellis. How are you, Bob? All right, good deal, Jason. Glad you got it. Mail has been touch and go these last couple of months, that's for sure. That is for sure. Really bothering me about this pin, gang. I'll find it. Or I'll run and grab another one, but... Joe Kelly, Joe Kelly, how funny was that? Eight games suspended. My gosh, they lowered the boom on that man. Hashtag free Joe Kelly. I thought that suspension was ridiculous. <laughs> Eight games. Eight games. Uh, Bob, yeah, I got your email. Um, is that was that the incorrect email, or were you talking about a package, sir? Did I just uh, reach out to the wrong email in response for tracking or something, or are you having a problem with an actual piece of mail getting to you? Still looking for my pen. These two cards are going to be the first cards we start out with in auction. A package. There's Jason. Hey, buddy. There's Fester. Sent a package and the tracking shows it was delivered to Kentucky. Uh-oh. see well we'll get it straightened out did it have your name on it and the tracking number but the tracking actually got delivered to somebody else or because on the email it actually I couldn't I'm not seeing any content in it Bob
hope everybody is having a good evening. We won't be too long before we get started. Trying to help Mr. Ellis out real quick if I can. Not if I can. I'm sure I'll be able to find out what had happened. Barry. Oh no, Bob, I haven't had any packages delivered back to me. Um, if you would, if you've got the tracking number, um, send it to me. Uh, like I said, where I've got a picture of it, I'd be glad to, be more than glad to find out what had happened with that, sir. Yeah, I checked the email and just did not have tracking in the content. I was wondering where I just may have had bad email, sir. So yeah, we'll definitely get it sorted out. But no, sir, have not had anything sent back to the house. That is odd, though. That is weird. Like I said, definitely want to get it sorted out, though. But we'll, we will do that uh, this evening. And I'm off tomorrow as well, so I've got time to dig into it. We will certainly get it sorted out and make the, make the post office find it and get it to you. And if you can, with that tracking, let me know, Bob, if uh, there was a reason or anything on it that you saw, or just send me the tracking and I can, I'll can i dig into it. I'll find out, but if you've got the number on it, we'll get. I won't make you do the work on it. And just another minute, guys, we'll get started. Uh, we'll start the auction here with a couple nice 2014 Panini cards. Uh, I've got a draft pick here for Trey Turner. And the better of the two is the uh, Rookie Rain, Xander Bogarts Parallel. Nice prism there. And the Bogarts is actually numbered out of 75. So a couple nice 2014 cards to get us started. Got you, Bob. One second, gang, and then we'll get right rolling. I needed that pen anyway. Got this number down for Bob. Okay, Bob, I've got the tracking on that, sir. Let me make sure I got it right. 8827150903. Hey, Cardinals fan. I got one that did that too, Bob. Uh, one that left out of Columbus, coming to Kentucky, and ended up in Florida, and now it's back in Ohio. Um, so, yeah, I'll definitely check into it, buddy. That's no problem. We'll take a look at it. Thank you for letting me know, sir. And sorry to get back to you sooner. Like I said, I genuinely didn't know if I thought I just had a bad email for you in response. Thinking that it was just a bad email sent back to me. But we will definitely investigate. I'll make sure we get it taken care of. And obviously in the event, I'll make sure that you're whole at the end of the day, sir. I see Ryan there. Um, I'm not sure if James Johnson or Frank Rippin's in here. Uh, James, you've got a $15 carry from the last sale. Um, Ryan, you do have uh, $15 carried from the last sale. Uh, Ryan, I did find a box of Pro Debut to go through, so I uh, did find those for you. 
Um, oh, no, Bob, you did it fine, buddy. Like I said, it was just, I've been a hair busy and I should have probably reached out to get clarification. Um, but I appreciate you being patient. Yeah, we'll get it worked out, man. We'll find where that package is bouncing around. Um, Mike Rowe, I've got you paid up. Uh, James Johnson, 15. Ryan, 15. And Frank Rippon, 14 are the last carryovers, guys. And that includes shipping. Uh, Dan Pops, who was a first time buyer, has still uh, got a couple out there for $7 if we see Dan Pops in here. Um, so with <sighs> said I was going to say stop saying without further ado so let's get into that habit early guys hit the thumbs up if you would I'm ready to go if you guys are ready to go share the stream and I'll tell you what we'll let this run for a couple minutes we'll just start this auction it's a 2014 Panini draft pick Trey Turner and a 2014 Panini Prism Parallel Xander Bogarts. And Xander is numbered out of 75. We'll let this run a couple minutes to get us started and we'll start this auction at $1, guys. $1. There's Chasing Hits starting out at $1. Be a Bogarts rookie out of 75. Trey Turner, both 2014 Panini Prism. Got a big batch of optic numbers to go through tonight. A lot of new autographs. There's Barry coming in at $3. We won't let it go for too long, guys. Doesn't look like there's a lot of people in here tonight, which is good for the few of you in here. I have an entire box of optic numbers, and they are nice cards. Uh, if you guys didn't see the hot box recap, uh, too late now. Just hang out here in the cell, and we'll go over them. We'll call going once on the Bogarts numbered rookie and the Turner, both 2014. Barry's got it right now at $3. We will say going twice. And sold. Barry. Cards for days. Draws first blood. Three dollars. So... Good pick up there, sir. Hey, Chuck Dupree, how are you? Good to see you. All right, guys, we will go through the battery of autographs first, and then we'll get into those optic numbers. Uh, let me get the auto box out. We'll go right from the showcase floor to the box. We'll start out with what you see in front of us. Dale Murphy, I've got the Decades Best. Clearly authentic. Asking $50. Blue ink on the acetate. 
Very nice. Dale Murphy, 450. And lowering this to $35 tonight. We've got an Eloy Jimenez on card, Top's Finest, Refractor. Asking 35 on the 2020 Eloy. And a brand new low on the channel. Don't think I've had it this low. I might be wrong, but we're dropping down to $80 for the Fernando Tatis. Red, white, and blue. Prism Rookie. And this autograph is numbered out of 50. And we'll do 80 on it. Well, Chuck, I've had that Murphy for a couple weeks, sir. So if, if it's still around in another couple, buddy, it'll, it will be all yours. Uh, I'm asking $50 on the Clearly Authentic Tim Lincecum, the freak. The freak? I like Tim. He doesn't sign a whole lot, but I do like it on that throwback. Nice theme. Uh, asking $50 on the Tim Lincecum. And ten dollars on the Shin Su Chu out of its 2020 archives, the buyback, and this one's numbered out of 48. Do ten dollars, 2010 blue ink Shin Su Chu. Into the recent pulls, looks like now. Out of one of the last select hobbies, got the uh, rookie patch auto for Brandon McKay. This one is numbered out of 209. Sorry about any glare on there, guys. Check the corners. Autofocus may be our friend or not tonight. We can never tell. Anyway, $20 on the Rookie Patch Auto numbered for Brendan McKay. Asking $20 on it. Asking $15. I've got a Brendan McKay. This is a Prism Refractor. Rookie Select Auto numbered. This one is out of 99. And asking $15 on this McKay. Nice Refractor Auto for 15. 20 for the patch auto that's numbered for McKay and 15 for just the numbered auto. And freshly pulled from Optic, got the Prism Refractor Auto for Michael King for the Yankees, asking $5. Refractor Auto for Mike King for the Yankees. Get these down just a hair, and we'll scoot these up, show them off a little better. $5 on King Refractor Auto. Bob, uh, was that five a bit? Okay, Milamon King, Bobber, did you pull a Derek and get behind on the live, sir? 
I see Milam's name on King. And I've got $5 on Prism, Rangers, Heineman. Let's get this back a little bit while I'm showing them off, I guess, guys. Sorry. I've got Heineman for the Rangers, Prism, asking $5. This one's numbered out of 10. Heineman for the Rangers, $5, numbered out of 10. And we just pulled a Jordan Yamamoto blue parallel. Got a nice looking Yamamoto autograph out of the optic. Asking $12. Yamamoto is numbered out of 125. Yamamoto blue parallel auto for 12. Hey, we say TC. Yeah, we may pull the trigger on that Vladdy one day. And for five dollars, got the pink hollow Andre Jimenez, also freshly pulled out of optic. Nice auto for the Mets here. Jimenez for five dollars in the pink hollow. Asking $12, got a red parallel, Dustin May, rookie autograph. Just pulled this out of Optic as well. And the May auto is numbered out of 50. Asking 12 on Dustin May, red parallel auto. Pink Velocity. Were you wanting to buy that berry, or was I calling it something different, man? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm just learning these optic parallels, so I could have been calling it something wrong. Alright, who was first? Chasing hits on Jimenez... Uncle Fester, what's up, buddy? First one on the May. That's a good pickup. Okay, thank you, sir. Pink Velocity. That makes sense because that one's not numbered, actually, and then some of the other pinks um, are numbered. So if that one, Pink Velocity, that's good to know. Thank you, Barry. And Unc Fester, I see first on the May on mine. That's on my screen. Hey, Louie. Uh, we say James, uh, chasing hits beat you out. He was right above you on my screen anyway. I've got Unc Fester here on the May. And I've got a $10 Braden Shoemake Auto. This is out of the Elite Extra Edition. I've got a Shoemake Auto. This one is uh, numbered out of 75. Do 10 on the Shoemake. Hey, Mr. Hart, good to see you, sir. Welcome to the channel. No, Louie, we haven't been going but just for a few minutes. I was... Uh, Bob Ellis has a package bouncing around the postal system, so we're trying to get tracking, get that uh, track down for the first few minutes while everybody rolled in, and we've just been going through a few cards. Uh, 
and five dollars I've got a 2019 Corbin Burns rookie do five dollars on Corbin Burns sharp looking card nice corners chromed out what's up Clay good to see you, Mr. French and for five dollars each we've got mojo autos 2020 bowman five dollars on aaron shortridge and asking ten dollars on braden shoemake so five for Mojo Short Ridge and ten dollars for Mojo Shoemake. Okay, Mr. Ellis Short Ridge, see sir. Mr. Milam on Shoemate. Which will take us to a $6 John Duplan tier. And this is his optic. Sorry, guys. Got an optic rookie. Get there at 75. Blue border, Duplan tier rookie for six dollars. Numbered out of 75. I'm not sure, Fest. I haven't seen uh, I haven't seen Short Ridge before in Bowman to check for that. That's good eyes, though. And for five dollars, uh, six dollars on the numbered Duplantier rookie auto. Six dollars on the blue, and five dollars on Duplantier Chrome. I've got Chrome rookie. Uh, those scratches. I should. Let's go ahead and put this in a new top loader. I acquired this and didn't change the loader out and it looks like it's been in the same sleeve since he signed it all right six on the number do plantier and five on chrome on card for both of those that's weird it didn't transfer to mojo they must have got a I think they got pretty pretty rushed with those mojos what's up to bears guys if anybody wants for five dollars to own your all's first uh, redemption I've got a rookie redemption here uh, let's do it this way so everything's still covered on it but for five dollars we'll do the redemption We've got Danny Jansen this is 2019 Tops Chrome. We'll do it for five. You can see everything's still sealed on it. Do a Danny Jansen redemption for five. Bears, I'm doing good, buddy. How are you doing? And four dollars. I've got a 2020 Tops. Brock Burke for the Rangers with the 35 year stamp on it. Brock Burke for four dollars. Cards fan. All right, Cards fan, that moves you up to, to let's see, close to twenty dollars for tonight. But I do have some pro debut. I just wanted to let you know. I'm not sure. If you were on here earlier, Ryan, but you had $15 from before, and this will take you up to 20 And I do have some pro debut cards I'll show you, so just keep that in mind for your total tonight, sir. And I thank you, Cards fan, what it is to the stack.
Do I have a Cubs card? I probably have several Cubs cards, buddy. Uh, doing $5 on Miami Marlins. Harold Ramirez. This is from 2020 Tops. Ramirez for $5. Get a better look at it, guys. Sorry. We'll do this for five. Got a rookie auto, Patrick Wisdom, orange parallel, and this one's numbered out of 99. Do it for five. Wisdom out of 99, rookie auto for five. And here comes the Cub for five. Robel Garcia got an autograph from Prism 2020. Do $5 on Robel Garcia Auto. A Cardinals fan wants wisdom. Got you, buddy. Ryan, that's got you up to $25, sir. Up to $25, Mr. Cardinals fan, 1990. And asking $5 for Randy Arazarena. Very prolific autograph for Mr. Arazarena. Smiley face and all. Tampa Bay Rays asking 5 on Arazarena. MJ Melendez Bowman, three dollars. Zach Brown Bowman, twenty twenty, three dollars. Melendez Brown, both of those are three dollars. Uh, Fester actually pulled his auto. Um, there's a video that I've got posted. Um, we ended up pulling one of the autos. I think it was out of 125 from the Phenoms um, insert set. That was pretty nice. Not pretty nice. It was very nice. Best raw cards I've ever pulled. And I've got $4 on rookie auto for Jacob Nix tops and the 35 year throwback. $4 on Nix. And asking $15, got a Topps Finest 2020, Mike Chavis, nice on card, he's got a nice auto as well, $15 on Chavis. Oh, very nice, Fester. Oh yeah, Panini's just slow. I think uh, I've got an Eloy Redemption in with him, and after all the stories I've heard, I think they'll be backed up and then... One day we'll all be surprised in the mail, probably. Uh, 15 on the Chavis, if anybody's interested. $10 on Bryson Stott, Bowman's Best, 2019. Do $10 on Philly's up-and-comer Stott. And five dollars on 2020 Bowman Purple. This is out of 250. Got Logan Ice for Cleveland. Do that one for five out of 250. Logan Ice. Hang on. 
one, Redemption out of 99. I would be very impatient. It would be hard not to just drive to uh, the office, hand them the Redemption, and just tell them I'll have a seat and wait till Jason can come sign it. And then I'll go home. Next box is fun. All these new optics. And I do mean all these new optics. Hot box. We opened two hobby boxes. And one was definitely a hot box. So we've got a lot of nice cards in here. A lot of good numbered cards to go through. Fun stuff. We'll start with a nice prospect. We'll do $3 on this Adley Rushman rated prospect. Three dollars for Adley. And we got you, Hanio Suarez, Diamond King. We've got this parallel numbered out of thirty-five, asking four dollars for that. Suarez Diamond King numbered out of thirty-five for four. And Fester first on the Adley. And Fester taking Suarez too. That's a good pickup out of 35. That's a pretty card. I keep saying it every time I open these Paninis that uh, this year the Select, the Prism, now these optics that until you're holding them like I said they don't look as good but they are nice. Panini's been uh, doing a great job, humble opinion. That's probably understated. They've been doing a really good job this year. All right, brings us to our next one. This is Sharp. <laughs> uh, got Mookie Betts. Uh, this is a black border refractor, and this one is numbered 25 out of 25. Asking eight on this one, eight only. Eight on Mookie Betts. That is number 25 out of 25. eBay one of one. And if that's not enough for you Dodgers fans, we pulled the Cody Bellinger Diamond King Spirit of 76 parallel. And that is numbered, obviously, out of 76. And I'm asking $8 on this one also. A couple of sharp cards. Betts for 8 out of 25. Bellinger Diamond King 76 out of 76 both of those for eight dollars and fester coming in first on bets thank you sir got you on that one too 16. We'll just call it 15 on both of those faster. Knock a buck off. At least do that. Getting them both. Those are good ones. We got more good ones. Whew. All right. I'm asking eight on this one also. We've got the Ron Acuna Jr. Spirit of 76 All Star Parallel. And that one is 74 out of 76. Asking eight on the Acuna All Star. She's pretty. Asking $5 on the Davy Gruyon. This Davy Gruyon rated rookie. This is the Fort Knox parallel. This is number 10 out of 10. Fort Knox parallels are out of 10. So, got Acuna for 8 and Davy Gruyon for 5. Fester takes a Cunha. Next one coming up is probably the highlight, I guess, of the ones that we pulled out of the numbered cards. But we did pull the Christian Yelich All Star Fort Knox. This is sharp, guys. This is Yelich All Star Parallel. And it's numbered out of 10. It's eBay 101. It's 10 out of 10. Uh, I'm asking $25 for it. Uh, not any comps out there for this card yet. And every other comp 
uh, pushing around fifty to sixty dollars, and those are numbered out of like twenty-five. So I think twenty-five is a steal on that Yelich. Again, Fort Knox numbered out of ten. Uh, it's ten out of ten. That's a steal. That's a steal if anybody wants it. can think about that. I'll lay him up in front of Murph. 25 on that Yelich. We'll keep moving. Uh, I'm asking $4. Got the Luis Robert. Got Lou Bob, rookie. Mythical. Insert. $4 on it. That's a Sharp Robert card. And I'm asking 6 on his rookie. This is a Prism Refractor. This isn't the base. Asking $6. My Lamont, Gruyon, got you, sir. And Luis, tell me which one you want, sir. Do you want the uh, Do you want the four dollar mythical or the six dollar prism? Thank you, Mister Milam. You want both of those, sir? What's up, Fox Bama? How you doing, buddy? Just put both of those in your stack for 10, Louie, if you was wanting them both, sir. My chat may be behind. Just the prism? Okay. Six on the prism. Got you there, Louie. Gotcha, Fest. good place to be tonight. Rain is just dumping here in Kentucky. The wife's out getting groceries. She's a mad woman. She's going to bring back some dinner. I love her. But it is pouring the rain out there. She's going to be mad when she comes home. All right, guys. Staying with this big old stack of numbered cards. Asking, it's a deal. I'm asking $6. Got this Aaron Judge. Parallel numbered to 150. Got six dollars on this pretty red, white, and blue judge. Six on the judge out of 150. And it's no offense, but it's only going to be four dollars for Polanco in the same set. Polanco numbered out of 150, but he's a couple dollars less than Judge. Six on Judge. Parallel to 150. Four on Polanco. Parallel to 150. NBA's back. Good, man. Put some value to those cards again. Basketball's been killing it. Rain in Florida. Did you get rained out, cards fan, or did you get your game in early today? Bob Ellis on Judge. coming in now okay yep it's just been within about the past hour hour and a half here in Kentucky they canceled everything we were thinking about doing of course I've got a Boston Terrier and a Dachshund that are terrified of storm so that makes for extra fun here in the Stevens house and if it gets too bad we take one of the doggy Xanaxes and break them in half and everybody takes a Benadryl nap all right. Let's go $4. This isn't bad. $4. Got a red parallel for Shane Bieber. And Bieber's numbered out of 60. Do $4 on Bieber. Didn't go today. Okay. 
Hockey day, Saturday, all day. What's up, Breeze? Good to see you, ma'am. I'm asking $5. We've got the Mad Bum and the Black Stars. I'm trying to get up on it so you can see it. The background on these Black Stars set is awesome. Anywho, $5, Bum Gardener, Mad Bum. <laughs> Sorry. Trying to get it working here. Numbered out of 125. $5 on Mad Bum. Uh, here's the same thing, Black Star, Juan Soto. Soto's numbered out of 125, asking $6 on Soto. $5 on Mad Bum, $6 on Soto. Glad you're feeling better. I didn't know you are under the weather, sir. But since you were, I'm glad you are feeling better. Louie on the Soto, got you, sir. Yeah, this box was hot as a pistol, man. It was, it was loaded. Uh, it's actually two hobby boxes into one, but I posted the video with the hot box recap that has them separated that shows them. But, I mean, it was a David and Goliath stack. There were like five or six numbers out of the first hobby box. And then the one, uh, the second one that we opened, I think it was 19 or 20 numbered cards is what it ended up being. Uh, here's another nice one. We've got a Dustin May. We'll do this one for five. Dustin May rookie, black border. And this May is numbered out of 125. We'll do five on the May. Gotcha, buddy. Is that what happened? All right. Ah, I'm unfamiliar with migraines, but I know people do suffer with them. That does not sound like any fun. Oh, uh, where? Let's see here. So we had five on a Mad Bum. Had four on the Bieber. Five on the Dustin May to 125. And Fester on May. Got the uh, Black Knight parallel for Tony Gonsolin. Do that one for $4 out of 125 Guys, if I didn't mention before, 25 that's going to be the new thing. 25 and shipping's free, so anybody that gets to 25 tonight will ship. Uh, guys that have already paid from the previous sale, you guys shipping's already paid uh, if I haven't shipped out. But that would only be uh, James Johnson, Chris Micro, uh, Frank Rippin, Cards Fan, and Lynch. I haven't seen Mike in here tonight, but I'll catch up with him. Uh, got some Carolina Blues here out of 50. I've got rookie Sheldon Noyce. Do this one for $4. That one's numbered out of 50. And $5 on George Springer. And Springer's numbered out of 50. Got four on Noyce, five on Springer, and they're both numbered out of 50. What's up, Danny? Good to see you, buddy. View. And next stack. These uh, the next orange parallels are out of 100, and they'll be three dollars a piece. I've got Logan Allen rookie in orange for three. I've got Jorge Soler orange for three, and Abraham Toro orange for three. And those are all out of a hundred. on Toro. 
I was glad to get an Abraham Toro card that had him in something other than that all white uni. Glad to see the little variation. Alright, thank you, Mr. Ellis. Oh, thank you, Danny. $25 will take it. I know it's well under comps, but that's one of the Fort Knox uh, parallels out of 10. And if you check, you can check the comps on it. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to sucker anyone into a sale, but I, there's no comps on this one out of 10. And the only other thing I've seen was the case hit, the SSP, and it sells for about 75. So I may end up, like I said, I may double this by the next sale if nobody takes it tonight and the comps come out just because it's 10 out of 10, but definitely a pretty card. Definitely a pretty card. Barry, I'm sorry, man. That happens to me sometimes in Ethan's sale, um, and I, I don't know how that happens. I'll, I'll come out and I'll refresh, and it'll show that I'm live. But it's still like I'm not getting the feed fast enough. That definitely happens to me. Um, I do apologize for that, buddy. I don't. I, that's kind of out of my control. I do hate that it's happening, though. Or Bob Ellis is a cheater. We have accused him before of having witchy ways of buzzing in too fast. <laughs> and I'm just joking, Bob. We're not going down that road. You're you're a man of ethics and fast fingers. We'll keep cruising. Uh, next ones are out of 199, and these are the pinks that Barry was nice enough to correct me on. And we'll do these for we'll do these for three dollars a piece on all the pinks. And again, the pinks are these are all numbered, so we'll do three dollars on Story, three dollars Albert Pujols. $3 Masahiro Tanaka $3 Joe Palumbo and $3 Chris Paddock See Tanaka. Thank you, sir. Unc Fester. Who holds? I see that. I've got a Prism Advert Alzale for four dollars. Prism Refractor, do the Alzale rookie for four. Do four dollars on Joe Adele. Rated prospect, up and coming stud. Joe Adele, four dollars. Got a Boba Shet rookie for four dollars. Base rookie Boba Shet, four dollars. And six dollars on the Prism Refractor Bichette. Got both of those base for four and Prism Refractor for six. Hey Sean, how are you buddy? Breakers are us. I see you, sir. Bob's taking them both. Alright, Bob. Thank you. Mr. Ellis, I've got a 
We'll do three and five. I've got three dollars on prospect base for Alex Kirilov. And we'll do five on the Prism Refractor Kirilov. Three dollars Kirilov base, five dollars Kirilov Prism. I'm pretty good, Sean. I'm pretty good, sir. Um, little bum still. I'm not going to gripe about not being able to go to South Carolina, but um, I think the Joe Kelly story is keeping it alive in baseball today. It's about the funniest. About the funniest. Hey, Pilly Mama, how are you? All right, next up is $5. I've got the Shohei Otani and the Illusion Insert Prism Refractor. $5 Otani Refractor. Or $5 on the Aaron Judge Prism Refractor. $5 for Otani Refractor. $5 for the Judge Diamond King Refractor. Unc Fester first on show. <laughs> Is that what I need? A little preview box or something like they have on the on the poker channel to hide my hand? Bob's just keeping his edges sharp, guys. No, I, I, I honestly, I run through the same thing. Sometimes I'm the first one in the chat and my text is first no matter... I don't know. It, I, 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 have, I can't explain it other than... Sometimes my connection seems like it's the same and I'll be I'll be lagging in somebody's stream. I can never make it up. Would like to know why. And Bob Bellis Judge. <laughs> hey Sam, it's good to see you, buddy. I do see Bob on Judge. That's pretty judge and pretty Otani. And four dollars coming up, Bryce Harper refractor out of the stained glass. The normal stained glass, just a white base. Four dollars for the Harper refractor, though prism. And I did it for the first time. I made it. I made it a while, guys. But I wrote the player down instead of the instead of my favored customers. There, Bob. Sorry. Or. Sam, I'm good, man. I'm having a good evening. Uh, we'll do $4 uh, like this Yelich. I've got the Prism uh, Refractor. Do that one for 4 I'll do $4 on the Stained Glass Gavin Lux. Do Lux Stained Glass for 4 and that is the base. And these last three are four dollars a piece. Last three are four dollars. Got Dustin May, base rookie. Gavin Lux, base rookie. Brennan McKay, base rookie. Last ones for three dollars, guys. And that was a big old box of optic. I'm gonna leave that up there. If anybody decides they want to pull the trigger on that Yelich for 25, we'll leave that one up there for a few minutes. Gotcha, Mr. Fester on the Lux. Base rookie, got it. Got it, got it, got it. Absolutely. Twelve, fifteen, nineteen, 
34, 42, 46, 51, 54, 59. Uh, 62 right now, Fester, and that's shipped free, sir. 62 with free shipping. Uh, if you weren't in here, Sean, I did get this out of Optic. We pulled this Yelich, uh, selling it for 25 It's the, uh, sorry about the glare. It's the Fort Knox Parallel, and this one's numbered 10 out of 10. Uh, just a dandy of a card. Don't have any comps. The closest comp on it was the SSP case hit, the Fort Knox case hit, and it's 75 So... Honestly, I was just taking a shot to to get it moving for twenty five. Um, I'm being truthful. Not no sales tactics. If it does not sell for twenty five, uh, y'all don't be mad if you come back next time and it's forty or fifty. If I find some comps on it, I was just trying to sling it for a little cheaper than I thought it would be. But like I said, just please don't be mad if it gets more expensive. I'm I was kind of flying blind with it without the comps. Could come down. Like I said, if it gets cheaper, but. I got a stern feeling with everything being in the sixty to seventy dollar range. That one's going to move up a little bit. Faster, thanks, buddy. My gosh, in and out like a shark. In and out like a shark. Here we go, guys. I'm going to do a gas on the fire auction with some Bowman numbered cards. Uh, I've had some cards come in and some ones I do want to get rid of. So if you guys are bare with me, I'm going to start an auction out at $1. And I'm going to keep adding cards to it arbitrarily. And every $5 that we hit on the auction block, I'll add some more cards to it. Uh, we tried this in the last sale and it was alright. Like I said, if you find cards in here that are decent, uh, you can jump in the auction at any time. We'll let it run. We'll give it the old going once, going twice sold. Uh, but again, the only rules for this auction are every $5 that it gets bidded up, I'll add some more cards to it, and I'll put a good starting lot out there. Uh, try to entice you guys for a dollar to get it kicked off, okay? So what we'll do is we'll start it out with five cards in the beginning, okay? Uh, we'll start it out with a J.J. Blade Bowman Paper. Started off with a Joe Adele Bowman Paper. We'll add to it a Luis Robert Bowman Paper. We'll add Travis Demerit out of 500 or 499 Bowman Paper. And I'm going to add Eddie Rosario Bowman Paper out of 75. And those five cards, guys, I'm going to start the auction at a dollar. Anybody can start, and we'll start right now. Opens up, bids at a dollar, guys. Start it out. I see Louie in for a dollar. That's the first bid, one dollar. I see Breeze move up to three. I see Bob at five. I see Cardinals fan at five. So it goes to Bob Ellis. Bob Ellis has the pleasure at five dollars right now, guys. Let me add a few more cards since we're at five. How about this? How about a purple parallel unnumbered? Bowman Chrome Carter Key Boom 2017 Purple Bowman Chrome Carter Key Boom and I'll add Ronaldo Hernandez from 2020 Bowman that one's a refractor Chrome out of 499 Cards Fan moves it to 6 Breeze Cards takes it back at 7 $7 is the bid right now Seven dollars looking at about twenty dollars worth of Bowman cards and numbers right now. I see Bob Ellis at eight. Bob Ellis has the pleasure at eight. I'm gonna add Justin Dunn, baby blue out of four ninety nine paper. Just to keep it going. And I'm going to add this 2019 Bowman Chrome Key Brian Hayes out of 125 just to keep it going. Oh, Cardinals fan at 10, Breeze back at 11 means I have to add cards now. So let's go back to 2018 Bowman Chrome 
Let's add the Phillies. Dylan Cousins, Mojo, Purple, out of 250. Let's come back to this year. Let's pick up Reds. Richie Hines, numbered. That one's out of 299 in the Silver Shiny. The Cardinals fan has the pleasure. $12 right now. 12 will take what looks to be $30, $35 at least in Bowman colored cards. Justin was drafted by the Mets. Fun fact. Says Pilly Mama. What I have here. Drafted by the Mets before he moved to the Mariners. Gotcha. Do they regret that? Is Dunn making him pay? I see Bob Ellis to 13. I see Cardinals fan to 14. Here's a fun one to add. What about a 2016 Bowman Chrome Mini numbered... <laughs> 15 out of 15. Check out that little fella. Yeah, baby. Let's add Chris Owings to the pile. Cardinals fan has the pleasure at $14. $14 takes the lead. A hearty selection of Mojo's numbered cards. A nice little stack. $14 will take it right now, guys. It's a nice stack. Not ashamed to let it go with that at all. 14 to Cards Fan Run right now. Bob Ellis takes it to 15. So I'm going to add 2018 Green Parallel Stephen Duggar Bowman Chrome numbered out of 99. And I'll come back. Let's add Let's add a Sapphire Anthony Prado in case anybody doesn't have a first Bowman Chrome Sapphire Prado. 15 to Bob Ellis. Let's call it going once. Going twice. Bob Ellis to 15. Congrats, Bob. Heck of a stack. Let's make sure the USPS gets it to you. That's a nice stack for 15. Congrats, Bob. Let's give a card away. Let's give it, we haven't given anything away yet. Everybody's still in here. Thanks for hanging out. Let's take a quick break. Let's give a card away. Let's give away. Let's give away the George Brett short print. I love this card, man. Short shorts, warm up bat, George Brett. Let's do the random chat, guys. I'll put the number down first. So we will know. All right, guys. Number has already been written down and covered up. Let's scoot it all back so we know. 1 through 50, guys. We'll give it a minute. And this is the one we're going for. Enter a chat, guy, or a random number. Sorry, enter a random number. 1 through 50. Please don't duplicate them. And if you have duplicated it, please just pick another number. We'll give it a minute. Everybody enter a random number. 1 through 50. Give away the Brett short print. Hey, Truth. Good to see you, sir. 
Good to see you. And I can't stop it uh, in this event because I literally, between a couple of numbers, forgot what I'd written down. Normally, I keep the number and I'll stop it if I see somebody guesses it on the dot, but we'll just have to let it roll and we'll all be surprised. We'll give it another minute or so, guys. Give it another minute. We'll say about 30 seconds, guys. We won't take too much time. About 30 seconds. Get your affairs in order, make a good guess. Then we'll be moving on to some nice prisms, some nice select cards. Oh, I forgot, shoot, I forgot. I've got a box, let me move this George Brett back. I forgot I've got a box of all these, <laughs> all, all the rest of the refractors, guys, and inserts and hot pulls from uh, the optics. Man, that's totally on me. I've got, I've got judges and Acunias <laughs> and more refractors. All right, guys, let's give this bread away. Let's give the bread away first before we get ahead of ourselves. Let's see who is closest. Magic. 48. Who guessed 48? Who guessed closest to 48? I'll put that in there for you, Ryan. Brendan McKay, got you, buddy. I do remember that from that base. Got you added in, buddy. And Ryan, that one actually will negate your shipping, buddy. So uh, $25, everything's paid up and good. Uh, $25 card fan. I just threw that one in because your shipping's already included, so... That'll be the same in my book, buddy. McKay's added, and $25 is still the total. Good deal. Breakers, all right. Was that you, Sean? Did you guess 48, or were you closest? And I've already got... Sean's already got a card from a previous sale. So, Sean, why don't we do this? You've got a card that was just like a 50-cent card. Let me put this in with the one you want and just send you both of those. You've got this uh, Sisto Sanchez. Uh, so if you would, uh, would one of my moderators please put my email address up? Sean, if you don't already have it, just send me your physical address and I'll get both of these out to you, buddy. Congratulations, Sean. If you don't check out uh, Chasing Hit or uh, Breakers RS channel, please do so. We run some fun sales. On the money. Man. That's my second or third sale where somebody has literally guessed the number out of fifty on the on the button. Still impressed we're chasing hits. Guess the Galarraga coming out of the signatures pack too. Uh, very, very nice. Alright guys. Uh, back into these optics. A lot of these nice inserts and refractors. Uh, we'll do these for a couple dollars a piece. This is the mythical set. I've got a Cunha Jr. mythical. I've got Bellinger in the mythical. Aaron Judge. Got two Acunas actually. These are pretty. Pete Alonzo. And Tatis, two dollars a piece, mythical. Cool. 
And next will be the prism refractors. We've been going over these. Uh, these are just separate from the base cards. So we'll do these at a couple dollars per also. If you need any of the prism refractors, we'll do Daryl Strawberry. These are all two dollars. Got Walker Bueller. Whit Merrifield. Trevor Story. Vlad Jr. Mookie Betts. Diamond King, Brian Anderson. Kevin Mitchell. Prospect, Mackenzie Gore. Yoan Moncada. We're going to keep these all at a couple dollars, guys. Uh, refractor, stained glass, Arenado. Bryce Harper, stained glass, base. Arenado, stained glass, base. Yelich. Chris Bryant. Glaber Torres. And the Illusion set, same thing, two dollars. Got Mookie Betts, Paul Goldschmidt, Josh Bell. Buster Posey, Austin Meadows, Eloy, and we'll finish it off with two dollar Diamond Kings, Acuna, Soto, Alonzo. Arenado, Simeon, Devers. Nice inserts in there, guys. And if you don't bite on them tonight, they'll for sure be a little bit cheaper down the road in one of the dollar sales. I have a stern feeling. But they're pretty. If you want them sooner, you can get them tonight. Moving on, I think we were going to get into the prisms, some more of the numbered selects, things like that. Finish it out. Had some pro debut also. Uh, Ryan, I was going to make you a deal on these, buddy. Um, I had all these uh, cards fans, so I don't keep you on here all night. I know I had told you about them. I've got a box here for $15, okay? It's Pro Debut and Cards Fan 90. This is specifically for you, buddy. I know you've been asking me a couple times, uh, so I did gather these. Okay, I can't uh, I can't go into them all in too much detail, but I've got all these 2019 debuts. A lot of good players. Didn't didn't pull any of the studs out. Left Chavis, Lizardo, Rees. Whitley, Dalbeck, Mauricio, everybody in there. Left them all in there uh, out of 2019. And then just a mix from 2018. Green, the guys we talked about, a few more from 19. And I just basically grabbed every pro debut that I had. Uh, if I put them on for basically a quarter a piece, cards fan, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 34. Call it uh, $10, Ryan. If you want these pro debut cards, all these for $10, uh, first right of refusal is going to go to Cardinals Fan 1990. Um, we'll do those for $10, Ryan, to get those out to you. But I did 
want to make that offer to you since you had asked me a couple times about those pro debut cards. So, Ryan, if you're out there, that offer for cards is out there for $10 for the pro debuts. Um, if Ryan's already jumped off for some reason or Ryan refuses them, they'll go to anybody else that wants them. It's a good stack of pro debut cards that I just collated from a, a dollar sale that I'd had and just put them all together. So we'll give him just a second and then we'll get moving. Ryan, are you out there, cards fan? Are you on the channel? $10 for all those pro debut cards and if not, we'll keep on moving. Uh, it'll also be in the stream too, so I guess Ryan could go back and look at them and buy them later uh, if we wanted to take that route. So it's out there. Um, if you don't, the rest of you guys don't care, we'll just leave that stack alone for a minute. Uh, let Ryan decide if he wants those. And if not, they'll be on the table for anybody else who wants to pick them up. And in the meantime, we'll keep pressing on. Got this prism. Cody Bellinger. Very nice. Uh, numbered out of 60. Ah, we'll do that for $4. Prism. Nice refractor there out of 60. Do that Bellinger for 4 We'll do for $4 also the Now On Deck Lou Bob, Luis Robert Prism, Now On Deck. So you can get a Cody Bellinger out of 60 or Luis Robert for $4 a piece. For $6, I've got a numbered Eloy Jimenez rookie. This is the Panini Timeless Treasures. And this Eloy, $6. Numbered out of 199 Eloy rookie out of 199 for 6 For $5, I've got Dylan Cease. Panini Select in the green. And that's num where'd it go? Numbered out of ninety-nine, five dollars on Dylan Cease Green. Four dollars for CJ Abrams on the Phenoms insert. Four dollars for CJ Abrams. Or $4 for Panini Select, Nico Horner, rookie. $4 on Nico. Do $4 on Panini Select, Gavin Lux in the Premier Tier. $4 on Lux. Do five dollars on a Walker Bueller optic rated rookie 2018. Five on Bueller rookie. us through that box. Alright, 
I'm going to have another auction, see if anybody's paying attention for some nice Bowman cards. We'll do it just like the other one. We'll start out with a lot, and I'll start them at a dollar. And they may go five cards for a dollar with no action, or we may bid up, add some more to it. I've got a big stack to choose from. We will go Gerard Encarnacion, first Bowman. I'll just do two Encarnacions to start. And we'll add a couple of Paulsons. We'll add Nico Horner. I will add Shirt and Apostle. And we'll start this auction at a dollar. One dollar, guys, if anybody wants to open it. Holy crap. Oh, I'm just now getting text, guys. My bad. Golly. Eek. <laughs> have no clue what happened with the chat gang hold on I'm just now seeing that I see it guys hold on hold on we'll back it up we'll back it up cancel the bowman sorry I'm glad I checked my phone and thank you to buddies who are letting me know let me get back on this and see where I failed ah <laughs> uh... Not sure what happened, guys. Streamlabs has failed me, it looks like, because I uh, don't have the chat. I'm going back. Hold on, guys. I will reset this auction. I'm not seeing any of this. Oh, my gosh. Thank y'all, man. Jeez. I didn't see Void come in, hobbyist. I look like a jerk. Hey, slob. Yeah, I don't have any of this chat. Oof. I'm going back. I see Barry in here at $2 each. So let me get through this. Holy crap. All right, guys, I'm going to run the chat off the phone, it looks like. Thanks, Void. Okay, let's go back to Ryan. I did make that one first. I'll get those Diamond Kings out of the box. We'll do that. Ryan, $10. You're up to $35 now, Ryan. Cardinals fan, sorry, man. Me, uh, I have no clue. The chat just literally took a crap in the uh, on my Streamlabs screen here so I don't I can't offer an explanation I'm moving this uh, pro debut box to you Ryan again apologies sir you are up to $35 and I'll do my work from the phone now uh, let's go back and I had to come out of this last box so here. I'll get these Diamond Kings if y'all do still want those. And I'll just reduce them to uh, a buck a piece. Cards for days. Frank wants uh, Posey. Jong, the cards fan. I'm just throwing that one in there for you. Or Goldschmidt. Got you there, cards fan. That'll just help me get caught up quicker too. But... Let's see. No idea. If anybody's ever seen that in Streamlabs and wants to let me know what could be causing that, I'd be, I'd be interested. That's embarrassing. Let's get it back here. Frank, I think that's your first one for tonight, buddy. 
Get with Chris Micro, though. If you pay shipping tonight, he's got something he wanted to send to you. for days I do see there again apologies Barry I don't know what Streamlabs did all right we're good and I'll start that Bowman auction back up let me get this Barry I do see that Acuna Cardinals I got you that Paul Goldschmidt and we'll caught up not the pro debut Frank wanted Bellinger like a little stack here get this Bellinger to Frank stack and we'll be moving I'll be caught up for two card for days once okay all the pro debut and the Bellinger and the Bellinger and the card for days on Robert okay I'm going to get that back out let me get Bellinger uh, Barry I've got you on that sir bonus one in there same for Frank the tank again Frank get with micro because he did have a nice card to uh, that is getting out to you uh... all right and now we'll start this but I will re restart that Bowman auction Bellinger 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 who had the coat let me see that's the last one I think I need to get caught up Frank the tank okay let me get a Frank's pile Okay, back. Get that Bowman stack back out and we'll get cracking again. I'll just run it from the phone, guys. We can, I can do that. Hey, Stimmers, how are you, buddy? Is Boba Fett up to bat? All right, guys, here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to restart this auction. Okay, uh, I, I apologize for this, but we're just going to call a clean break. I'll put the cards back up. Uh, we know what they were, and then we'll just say go. Uh, it was Horner. It was Pawson. It was Encarnacion. It was Apostle. It was a, uh, Pawson again. It was Encarnacion. Okay. All right, guys, we'll start this out at $1 for this Bowman auction. Start it at $1. I see Louis in for two. If we're all caught up, guys, I think I am. If not, you let me know. I see Louis Reyes winning this auction right now for $2. Hey, Kenny. I see three to Kenneth. I think we're back, guys, or at least I am. I think I'm caught up live, and if I'm way behind, y'all let me know. But I think we're, think we're good to go. Kenny winning this auction at $3, guys. Same as the other ones. We get uh, $5 increments. And I'll start throwing more of these Bowmans on. There's Bob Ellis at five. That's it, Void. It's worth it in the acrylic alone. So let's add Bowman, Chrome, Alex Kirloff. Let's add Paper Rookie, Dylan Cease. Let's add Rookie, Jesus Luzardo. Bob Ellis still has the pleasure at $5. Let's add Dustin May, rookie. $5 to Bob Ellis. 
I see Cardinals fan up to six. I see Ryan with the lead at six dollars. I see Kenneth at seven. No, Ryan's a fighter. Ryan dug deep, towed the line at the last auction. Stimmers had a cheater. Oh, that sucks. I see Cardinals fan at eight. It's Cardinals fan pleasure at eight dollars right now. And Kenneth with ten. Let's add Nico Holsizer, first Bowman paper. Let's add Bryson Stott. Let's add Jaron Durant. Let's add Everson Pereira. I see Cardinals fan jump to 12. Let's throw a wild card in there. Let's throw the old 2011 Bowman Chrome Prospect Starling Marte Still to 12 Double for Boba Fett B -b -bo with the d -d -d double I see 13 I see 14 Cardinals fan 15 Bob Ellis means we add more cards Let's add Chrome, Jacob Amaya. Let's add Mojo, Sejas. Let's add Camo, Pardino. Let's add Chrome, Pardino. Frank the Tank comes in with 20. $20. Frank has the pleasure. Frank the Tank has the pleasure at $20. Cardinals fan, 21. Kenneth Moore, 25. Here it comes. I'm going to have to move them and start new, guys. Just a good stack. I come back. Let's get another Paulson in the mix. Let's get Seha Space Chrome. Let's get another Kirloff Chrome. Get Dustin May, Rookie of the Year. Ooh, let's add this one. I'm Jordan Yamamoto Mojo. It's not Bowman. This is out of the uh, Silver Pack. But Yamamoto Mojo. We'll keep it going. $25, Kenneth Moore's Pleasure. 26 cards, fan. See the lead to Ryan at 26. And we'll be putting a lid on this one, guys. We'll be wrapping this one up soon. Let's call it. Let's call going once. Ryan Cardinals fan has a lead at 26. Let's call it going twice. Let's call it sold to the Cardinals fan 1990. 
$26. So Ryan, that does take us up to $61, sir. That's shipping included. Cardinals fan 1990, we are at $61, sir. Good buy, strong buy. Now I have to put Cardinals fan in a box of its own once it's time. What's up, Andy? How are you, buddy? Just putting the finishing touches before we nod out before Papa J takes over. Anybody want an Albies holiday for three? Reese Hoskins 2018 Bowman Platinum for three. Did I? Okay, now you've got to help me out in the chat, guys, because this is what we've come to. Did Kenneth get the 27 in before somebody help me? Did Kenneth get to 27 before I made the announcement? Was my chat lagging and Kenneth won it, or did Cards Fan win it and Kenneth came in after that? You guys will have to help me out with that. I probably will not see that time difference. So you guys, you guys, if you would, help me on that. And we'll be polite and let the winner have it for sure. And Kenneth was, at, Kenneth was after I'd said sold. Okay, I, did, I want to make sure that I didn't... Nope, sold before he put it... Okay, I, no, no, I just want to make sure. And it's probably lagging for Kenny like mine is right now. Okay, very good. Uh, didn't see anybody sold on these. And I've got a $15 slab. Panini Chronicles, Victor Robles, Jim Mint 10. Asking 15. This is Panini Chronicles, Revolution. And... Asking $8. Got a Jorge Alfaro rookie. Clearly authentic autograph. Forgot to show that earlier. $8 on Alfaro Rookie. What happened to you, Andy? You know, I did hear Papa Jay say that you were a little under the weather. Whatever it was, man, glad you're feeling better. Sorry you weren't feeling good in the first place. Frank wants out Faro. Oh, that's a bad combo. That's a bad combo, buddy. I ain't glad you're feeling better. Frank the Tank go. Okay. Uh, has anybody seen Frank B. Rippin? Uh, if not, I'm going to put this Lariano autograph back up. I uh, was asking 15 for it, and Frank had claimed it, but I never had heard back from him. Uh, is Frank B. Rippin in here? I called it out at the beginning, but never saw him. So, uh, $15, I guess, on this Lariano. Uh, we'll offer that one back up. No, no, that's no problem, buddy. I'm sorry, Kenny. I, it happens to me all the time. Happens to me all the time. And if not, I'll get back with Frank and see. Uh, let me see, guys. I think that's everybody caught up, honestly, man. Uh, don't want to say that, but I do think that's the case. Definitely the case. All right, guys. Uh, give everybody one last stab at that Yelich at 25 before 
uh, close the shop for tonight and start studying those comps and change my mind. So uh, one last yab at the Christian Yelich Fort Knox All-Stars eBay 101, 10 out of 10. I'm asking 25 on it. And like I said earlier, don't be surprised when we come back if that one's not a little bit more expensive. Uh, Frank Tank, don't worry if Frank Rippon uh, doesn't send me something tonight to let me know. It'll be held either way. So we will work something out if Rippon ends up not wanting it. No, that's no problem, Kenneth. That's no problem. Uh, guys, y'all have my email if you want to talk about any cards, but uh, 747 is about time to wrap it up. I know Papa Jay is going to get rolling here in just about 10, 15 minutes, and that's where I want to be. Uh, so I'm going to start invoicing everybody. I'm going to give you all totals. Uh, we'll get everybody caught up. So if you guys hang with me just one second. Bob Ellis, thank you very much. And Cardinals fan Ryan, big buyer tonight, sir. Big buyer tonight, $61 to Ryan. So, Ryan, what I'll do for being my big purchaser tonight, once I see that $61 payment, I will throw in an extra couple Cardinals cards for you. Uh, just for making a big purchase and letting you know that I thank you for coming around, Ryan. And I hope you get to make it to your baseball games this week, sir. I hate everybody getting rained out. Uh, Frank, let's go 8, 10, call it. Frank Tank, $12 card shipped everything. And I thank you. If you want to talk about anything, let me know. But uh, Micro added a card. Uh, I can go ahead and show you what... I don't think it was a surprise, but be sure and reach out and tell Chris Micro thanks because he added that to your stack today. So I wasn't going to make anybody pay shipping on it, but now that you're in here and shopping, I'm going to ask you to pay for that $4, but it's going to equal a Logan Webb Patch Auto added to your stack. So $12, sir, and tell Chris Micro thank you. Uh, didn't see Don Pops in here, so I'm going to put his cards back up. Uh, he actually won a freebie and then got a Bregman patch. Nobody's probably going to be too interested in that. But I'll put those back out for the next sale. Uh, Mike Lynch, you're already paid up, buddy. I'll just get these shipped out. Uh, Micro was already paid up. I didn't see him. Uh, see, Ron, we already got your total. Luis Reyes, all I've got. Uh, $10, sir. We'll take care of everything for you. Cards and shipping, sir. And I'll have these out. I'm off tomorrow. If I don't get these actually to the courier tomorrow, I'll work Saturday. So we won't be more than a day or two from shipping, I promise. And Bob Ellis. Bob Ellis. Free shipping for sure, Bob. We've got 11. And uh, Bob, once I finish getting these invoices checked out and decompressing, I've got that tracking number written down, and I'll go to work on that. We'll find that. Um, and if I need to get a hold of the post office tomorrow, I'll make that note and we'll do it. Uh, let's see, we are at 11, 14, 17, 27, 32, and 15. 47, Mr. Ellis will take care of cards. I'd be pleasured to ship those to you for free for being such a good sport. And for the debacle, let's throw you in another card tonight too. Appreciate you, Mr. Ellis. I'll be in touch with you. I've, like I said, I do have that tracking number, so we'll get it knocked out. We'll get it taken care of. And we'll go postal if we have to. Just kidding. Uh, FBI, CIA, if anybody is uh, listening from your drones, that was absolutely a bad joke. Don't kill me. Uncle Fester, I get you your total, sir. Sent and thank you, Jason. Chasing hits, I'll catch up with you. No, it's just 10, Lewis. 10, ten dollars. Mr. Milan, five and 10 and 20. But you shop with me too much. 
I ain't gonna let a couple dollars spoil that. Jason, if you're on here, just send me twenty dollars. Let me send these out to you, and I thank you, sir. Cards for days, Barry. If you're on here, sir, you got a couple decent cards for cheap. Five dollars. Call it nine dollars, Barry. I'll send you an email, and I'm sure I'll be back in yours buying some packs sooner than later, sir. I've just uh, I've been busy. I've been busy. I try to keep a rotation of loyalty, and I've had to shrink that circle, unfortunately, just because of the baseball season. But I promise I'll get it widened back out and be buying from everybody like I used to. Oh, that's no good, Louis. Stay safe. Oh, yeah, Cards fan. Yeah, yeah, buddy. I'll tell you what. You got it. Let's do that right now, okay? So let's get Cards fan, because I did tell him that. And we'll witness that, okay? We'll, we'll send Ryan a couple. We'll make sure he's got Asher's autograph. And I will put my first one down. I've never signed one, so we'll do mine in... Let's do one in green here. We're done, buddy. We're signed off. I can do that, Ryan. Yeah, Frank. No problem, buddy. I don't know much of a stack that you had. Wait a minute. Was I, charging? I wasn't charging you for a card, was I? No, I'm sorry. Had you for a $6 Alfaro, $2 in inserts, and then 4 to ship. And here's that web that Micro was given to you. Is that good, sir, or did I do so? Did I get something wrong? Put these in card stack. So, yeah, Frank, definitely let me know if I put a wrong card in there or added one that you didn't want or did something like that, buddy. And I will put the PayPal one more time up there. No, nah, I'm glad to do it. Thank y'all. I appreciate it. I know Papa's getting going here in about five minutes, so if y'all want to bounce, I'm not going to be offended. Uh, I've got a Prism uh, hobby box coming and some more eBay purchases. So uh, you guys will see us on the channel opening our next hobby box before the sale. So We'll get your cards out uh, no more than a day or two. And hit Papa J up tonight, guys. He's going live just a few minutes. Thanks, Frank. No, you don't understand, Ryan. That makes old man feel good that you'd actually want him to put his scribble down on a card. Everybody wants Asher's. You're the first one, I think, that's actually asked for the old man's, too, so... Be glad to do that, buddy. Stroke at ego. Stroke at ego. Oh, is it 10 p.m.? Oh, good, man. You guys have time to catch a bite. I can get some Chinese food. Pour about two fingers of bourbon. I'll be settled right in. Papa pulled a fire for me last night, guys. Uh, or was it two nights ago? Uh, check his video out from his stream. He pulled, uh, I'll show you the picture of it real quick. He pulled this Aaron Judge tie-dye um, 25 out of, was it out of 25, 20 maybe? It's hot. It's a nice looking card. All I've got is just from is a eBay picture, I think, from when he was in the middle of opening it. Yeah. I don't know if you can see that or not. 
Look at that tie-dye that he pulled. That's a judge parallel out of select, and it's out of 20. So I can't wait to get that here. I've got some more hobby boxes coming, more good cards, eBay purchases, and all that good stuff, guys. So uh, email me if you have any questions or concerns, want to see different cards, uh, if I'm doing it right or wrong. Help me get it dialed in. Uh, Bob, I do have this tracking number. I'll get to work on that, buddy, shortly. Oh, yeah, Andy. Uh, I would let you pick amongst any of these pastel colors for a glute signing. <laughs> it was last night? Okay, James. Thank you, buddy. And I do still have yours held, Mr. Johnson, if you still wanted uh, uh, $15 takes care of cards and shipping for everything that you've got. And guys, I think that'll be about it. Uh, we can take a break. Uh, Papa J does fire up. I said 9 o'clock. That's on me, guys. It's 10 o'clock Eastern, 7 o'clock Pacific. So I can catch up on some baseball highlights, and then I'm going to cruise right in. I'm sure I'll see Andy there. Uh, guys, don't hesitate to tell Papa that I sent you. Uh, we appreciate letting each other know. Glad to support each other. It's a great channel. Um, if anybody else is in here that's providing content, be sure that you're subscribed to them. Oh, I can tell. There might be a there might be a fist fight over that judge. That judge is pretty. That judge is pretty. I've had a couple people ask me through text that were in there last night if it was gone yet. So. That'll be a hot ticket, but looking forward to it. Just I want to get it in my hands and see how pretty it is. Um, if you see Frank Rippin, tell him to get a hold of me. And other than that, guys, if you haven't already paid, I'll get invoices out, PayPal requests, carrier pigeons, whatever method works. Hobbyist, you take care. Void, Frank, Andy. Louie, James, Bob, Ryan, Milam, Kenny, Papa J, Fox Bama, Lynch. Got a lot of good buddies in here. I'm calling you buddies. You may not call me a buddy. I call y'all buddies. Uh, make sure y'all are checking them out. With that, guys, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. It was a fun sale. My apologies for the chat. I'm not sure what happened in Streamlabs. Uh, I'll take a look at that and see if we can't get those uh, burrs sanded off before the next sale or opening. But, again, all apologies. Uh, thank you all so much for sticking in. I, I picked up my phone and I had three different people sending me text messages. And Louie was actually calling me. Uh, I'll throw something in this. Thank you all. I mean... Just man to man, thank y'all. I appreciate that. Honestly, do. Um, I'll be sure to add something um, to your all stack for that. I'm rambling. I'm gonna get a drink, guys. Thanks once again for a fun sale. Uh, y'all take care and Stevens cards.